Oh, it's a me. <laughs> <laughs> Horrible Mario impression. Hey guys, it's Anime Case Woman Bird, and welcome back to Animal Crossing New Leaf. Uh, what the heck is that? Okay, it looks like a pitfall at first. Uh, today, I'm thinking, whoa, we got a lot of stuff. I think I ordered some stuff from the Nooklings. Uh, so today, I wanted to address this little guy over here. If the cicada would calm down, wherever it is. Shh, cicada, there he is. Let's get him. Get out of here. This is my house. I'm the mayor. Alright, so, <laughs> so I wanted to talk about this. This is a little flower here that I found on the other end of town. It's called a Jacob's Ladder. And uh, because that grew in town in Gooston, I have a good feeling that we're going to need to go talk to Isabel because she's probably got some good news for us. So let's go check the status of the town. Uh, past that, I'm going to kind of play it by ear and see what else is going on in the town today. Hello, Mayor Adam. Is there something I can help you with? Citizen Satisfaction. You want to know how satisfied the citizen goosens are? Sure thing. Here's what the Citizen Satisfaction Committee had to say. Why, it's amazing. I truly mean that. The town is simply the best. They've clearly worked very hard. This old man is really pleased. The survey also says the citizen Gooston feel Gooston is the best town ever. They never want to leave. After Mira just left. That's kind of weird to say. Mayor Adam, you've finally done it. Everyone loves Gooston. Man, she's like in my face. Right on my Mario nose, giving it a big old kiss. <laughs> like Peach. Uh, on behalf of the Citizen Satisfaction Committee, I'd like to thank you for all your hard work. In addition, the committee would like to propose a few special public works projects. They'd like to remodel the town hall and also build a new flower clock. If you're interested in either of those, please, con please consider them for upcoming public works projects. All right, Yahoo! It's, it's uh, we did it. Uh, <laughs> I was gonna say it's a Mario. <laughs> you guys know that. We did it! Yay! Okay, so at this point, I need to keep Gooston perfect for three weeks if I want to get the gold watering can. And I'm not sure if I can pull that off, but I'll give it a shot. Uh, oh, oh yeah, we got it. Let's go have the ceremony for this. Uh, we we finished the standee, and I really need to get a good design for it. I think I have a few. Um, I've got a few like stored in my my little patterns QR folder thing here. I'll have to look at that. I can't remember. Oh, <laughs> there was no room on the other side, so Pinky had to stay <laughs> up to the other. Yeah, it's like Elvis is all alone on the one side. Poor little guy. All right. Let's see, which one haven't we done in a while? Hmm, thank you, thank you. Let's make this short and sweet. Take it away. On to the next project. Whoosh. Mario's too cool for school. I need a better, like, Mario outfit, because I'm wearing the Big Bros shirt and hat and nose and everything, but it seems like Mario should have a cool overall shirt and some, like, little jean pants or whatever. Pop it. Bam. So yeah, I need a good design for the standee. What's, so what should we do? The flower clock or... The, uh, the town hall. I've seen the flower clock in a few, you know, different areas before. A few people's towns. Whoa, it's a bird wing. Crap, I want that. I don't have my, I need my net. Hurry, hurry, hurry. I want to get that. Usually the bird wings I try to hang on to because they're super good for bug catching contests, but I have no idea how long. And I think there's one more bug catching contest at least. There we go. It is 251.1. I can, I'll get more later. Let's see how these guys are doing. I haven't talked to some of, like, Pinky, I haven't seen her in a while. How's your morning, Spoopy? Hope it's great, Twinkles. What's up? I just want to chat. How's it going? Days like today are totally great for collecting figurines, right, Spoopy? What? <laughs> She's been hanging out with Graham, I guess. They're getting their nerd on. Hey, I've been hoping to see you, Adam. So what can I do for you? Really? What? Adam, I hope you can help me with my latest obsession, river fish. I have to have one, mm, baby. Any kind from any part of the river. Will you find one? Sure, that sounds easy. He's... He's like, the way he said mbebe makes it sound like he's hungry for, for eating river fish. Clog off! It's been pleasant today, hasn't it, Cluck Yeah? Is that something you wanted? Maybe not to talk to you, she just told me to cluck off. I have a serious problem with the fan palm in my home. It's not fitting in very well. I love how it fits up my floor space. Yes, it's a perfect shape, but I just don't like it. If you find something that takes up the same amount of space, bring it to me, okay? Hopefully it's something that will fit nicely with the style of my room. Aw, look at that. Pinky just watered that and then Graham stomped on it cute. <laughs> Alright, let's head back to Town Hall. I didn't talk to Elvis, but I don't want to spend too much time talking to the little animals. We're going to head back to Town Hall, and I... Ooh, there's some river fish. I want to start on the next public works project. I think I'm going to do the Town Hall remodeling, because that sounds a lot cooler than the, the flower clock. I've seen it before. It looks nice, but it's going to take up a good amount of space. Let's see if we can get this river fish. We've got to listen closely. And... There we go. I've been playing, um... Legend, I forget if I mentioned this. I've been playing Legend of the River King, which is an old, um, 
Game Boy Color game by Natsume, They're the people that made like the Animal or not Animal uh, Harvest Moon games. I used to be into the Harvest Moon games a lot. Those are pretty fun. Like you'd think a farming simulator wouldn't be very fun, but it is. And so Legend of the River King follows that idea that they're going to take something that seems kind of slow-paced and boring, like fishing, and make it exciting. And it's it's kind of a fun RPG. It's like you're trying to save your sister by catching this like magical fish, so but you have to walk around and like learn how to fish and do all this stuff first. But uh, it's it, once I learned how to actually fish in it, it was a lot better. Whoa! So we have like a Japanese town hall, a uh, like fairy tale looking one, and then a modern one. I think the, the Japanese one is like the best, definitely. Obviously, I, I like that style because my house is like that. Okay, we're not gonna be able to demolish it. It seems like you could just change it later, right? Even though she's like warning us. All right, so we gotta set up a donation gyroid. And that's it. All right. So I think I'm not sure if the gyroid's gonna be in here or if it's gonna be in the train station. Um, so let's head over to the cafe. I can I'll I'll talk to Copper first and see what else is going on in town. But I think we can head to the cafe and and get to work in here. So yeah, where is the gyroid? I bet he's in the town hall or the train station. That's usually where they put the gyroid when there's no other spots for it. So let's head over. I don't really know what this thing is still near my bamboo. Oh, I bet it's a bamboo sprout that grew. I was like, who's planting or putting stuff down there? I need to give Graham this carp or, or crucian carp or whatever I got. Yes, sweet. That's where the other one died, which is kind of funny. I'm going to plant this somewhere here. Where would be a good spot for some bamboo? Maybe right here. I'll try this. I gotta be careful with uh, planting my bamboo everywhere. It's gonna like make a little forest around my house. I'd like to like, oh, that would be cool to make like a perimeter to protect my house around with bamboo. That way ninjas can easily hide in it and kill me. That's like counter to what I'd actually want. Okay, notice the fireworks show starts huh. tomorrow night. Okay, so we gotta go do the fireworks. What? Today we have an extremely rare captain's monitor for sale. So rare it's magic, don't miss out. All right, and we got the standee made. So tomorrow's the fireworks. I, get, I could probably go see KK Slider tonight. I forgot about that. I haven't actually gone and seen him in a while because uh, the, the Nook store, TIY, actually sells the records. So it's like I'm not as compelled to go see him live because I can still get the records. But his live performances are a lot different. Whoa, look at all this stuff. We got a pitfall in here now. Good morning, Adam. Not going to be of assistance. I haven't actually like, collected stuff. Yeah, it's just Pete. Pete's just walking around. Let's check out what the shirt this is. The other one's like a checkered shirt. A four ball. <laughs> That's two guys hanging out. A four ball tee. All right. See you, buddy. Let's head to the ca the uh, roost. So the cafe. Same thing. The roost is the proper name. And we got to get our daily dose of pigeon milk, of course. I really want the, the Luigi mustache. Uh, cause I wanna I wanna complete my Lu Luigi costume, but yeah I don't know if I'll be able to find it. It's it's gonna be a while to get any of the Nintendo items that I want because or that I haven't gotten because there's only one. If I at best it seems like there's only one fortune cookie during the during this month because of all the fireworks stuff that they sell. Sometimes there's no fortune cookies. And then also I have most of the items, so it's like I'll probably just get duplicates for a while. So crossing my fingers and hope I get the little bros stash. Hey, give me the usual. Oh crap, where's my coffee sheet? I almost forgot. Okay, here we go. So let's check this out. So Avery likes, uh, I think he's Kilimanjaro. Yeah, and a little bit and one spoon. So yeah, yeah, I wanna... Oh no, 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 crap. Ah, I hit the wrong one. I can't go back to, I hit it. I was trying to like <laughs> move on to another topic of conversation. Oh well, I think you get points for every ingredient you get right. Maybe, maybe he'll like to go out of his comfort zone and try a little more milk. Probably not. Yeah, this isn't bad, but you should use the right amount of milk. Not bad. Not bad for a part-timer. I'll be back. Hmm. Let's see if we get any new villagers. Oh, okay. It's Graham. He's going to use his Jedi tricks. I like seeing the new villagers, but it also makes me, like, hope that, uh, that we could get one of them. Like, when Pietro visited, I was like, geez, he's my absolute favorite in terms of creepy villagers. <laughs> so... Uh, I have to check the campsite, but I think because Mira's gone, but because we already have nine villagers, we're going to have to wait until the campsite uh, has a villager come to uh, to let us get a new one. I know there's, like, tricks to get that to happen. Like, if you find a day where the villagers visit, you can keep, like, reloading the town without saving to do it. I don't know if I can... That would take forever. I've heard people... It's like trying to get shiny Pokemon or something. Uh, it takes, like, tons and tons of resets. Someone was like, it took me, like, 500 
resets, but I got the, the Julian or whatever, the unicorn, like the villager they wanted. I know Julian's one of the most popular villagers. Some of, it's like, I think each one of them have like a variation that's kind of cool. It's like, there's a unicorn instead of a horse. There's the like dragon instead of the crocodile. That's really cool. The mammoth instead of the elephant. So there's so many of those little cool variations. I'm trying to remember what others. People like Coco a lot. She's the the rabbit that looks like a gyroid or like a honey thing. She's got the creepy face with the <laughs> with the just dark eye circles. Let me take a swift of this delicious coffee. OMG! All right, this <laughs> is just gonna bust out her famous me moves. Let's see who we got for our special visitor. Does the mustache twist? <gasps> oh my God, he looks so weird without his guitar. His turntable. Barista, the usual, please. I don't know what your usual is, KK Slider. Oh my god. Okay, we're gonna try. He seems like a mocha guy, maybe? I don't know. I'm just trying to gauge from his look. He's wearing his, like, hipstery uh, DJ stuff. How about a little bit of sh He probably has lots of sugar because he stays up really late. And then, like, two spoonfuls. Of or no, I did oh, I did lots of milk and two... Okay, I just... I need to test different amounts and he'll say what he likes or whatever. Or what he doesn't like. So I tried two spoonfuls of sugar and lots of milk. Let's see if I'm hip to this coffee as a drip. KK, I gotta write him down. KK, hmm, it's nothing like my usual style. No soul, no sale. I'll be back, Jack. So all of those were wrong. No two spoons, no lots, and no mocha. I gotta note that down. I'm trying to write it real quick. Okay. Sorry, KK Slider. That is, that's so creepy seeing him like walk around like a, like a real person or a real animal. I wasn't expecting him to look like that. Alright, looks like you made the phone. I only get good. I usually get supreme. Man, I'm falling back. It's it's an off day for me. I could just blame it on Mario. Maybe they don't know that it's me. Anything special? Nope. Alright, I'm gonna have a cup real quick. And then I'll, I'll check what time it is because we could go see Shrunk in a sec here. We should go, we should stop at, um, I guess, uh, two spoonfuls of sugar. I don't usually put sugar in my coffee. I think I mentioned that. Like, I just put creamer in real life. But we should stop at TIY though, because I want to see what that captain's chair looks like. The special item. He's got a couple tiny gyroids on the shelf there. So I don't think Brewster lets lets me store gyroids like he used to in City Folk. That was like his big special thing, was if you drunk enough coffee with him, he'd let you store gyroids. But I guess, uh, I guess since we can store them as, as like a museum exhibit, they don't give us that option here. I wish they did still, because... Okay. I'm gonna have way too many gyroids to fit in the museum, I think. I've already had to, like, get rid of some duplicates, I think. But they're so... it's kind of rare, so it's like, I feel bad getting rid of them. Alright, so let's, uh, let's stop by TIY real quick. And then we'll, we'll head over and get one of the last jokes, man. I'm gonna be sad. I think he just repeats the jokes after, if you've gotten all of them, but... We'll have to see. And I've heard he has, like, a special... a special one for his last one, so we'll have to see what that's like, but, but yeah, I'm gonna, uh, gonna finish up with the jokes pretty soon here, it's a little bittersweet. Aw oh, man, so, see, today we got two different th firework things. Oh, there's, oh, is that the captain? It's like a captain's console, yeah, I thought you said chair. I've got one of these green clocks with the little baby sparkle design. What is this? Comrade KK, <laughs> is this like a Russian-y song? Oh, I, I should have listened to it. Thank you for your kind purchase. Let's grab this, too. This is pretty cool. Spotlight product of the day. Fancy the lovely captain's monitor? It's not that expensive, but it's probably rare. It's for, like, a space-themed stuff. Okie doke. Hey, Nan, how's it going? I'm gonna head over here and check out... Uh, I'm, I'm, I think I don't have too many more days before uh, Leaf will, will give me the golden axe. I still have yet to see a silver axe at the island, but, uh, but I want to get the golden axe if I can. Because that was one of my favorite Sega Genesis games. No. If I, if I buy 50 of these saplings, then I'll get the Golden Axe, I believe. But I, don't, I haven't had 50 days yet for that to happen. I'll come back and get the rest of this stuff. I usually just buy his plant. Just, you know, feel bad for the little guy. No. I want to catalog everything, so so it's worth buying some of that stuff. We could stop at the Able Sisters real quick. Don't want to go on too long, obviously. And, uh, man, I really want to get the... I had something special planned for the uh for the luigi's costume when i put the mario one i was on like i was like i wish i had the luigi costume because i want to do something with that but now i uh i don't know what to do because i can't get the last piece to it oh we're talking about saturdays 
being their busy days. Cranston's looking around. Maybe you should change your shirt, Cranston. Um, but yeah, I, I got a special plan for the Luigi thing. I don't know if I can pull it off, though. So we got... Oh, there's the, like, kindergartner hat. This is, like, the little... The hat that I think... Yeah, it's a school hat. Little kids in Japan will, like, wear these. I think it's to keep track of them a little better. So they don't, like, wander off and get lost. Aw, it's so cute. Let's grab that. It reminds me of, like, an explorer's hat. Oh, <laughs> the Mario clothes. I forgot it does that when you put them on. Alright, so we're gonna head over to Shrunks and finish up with a joke. Some of these aren't even jokes. They're just, like... I guess they're jokes, but the expression doesn't... It's not, like, that jokey. It's, like... It's, like, a sad joke. <laughs> so anyways, one one last stop. I wanna... I don't usually do the shop stuff very much, so I wanted to make sure I, I do a bit today, since I was like, I might as well go through these. <gasps> There's a Zen door. I think I have this one, right? Don't I have the wrap? Oh no, it's the arch door. I have the Zen door. I, I might try the arch one, or the... Yeah. Let's try that. Okay. And then nothing else looks that great. Okay. Let's see. Are you gonna give me your, your special dialogue here? I'm a little worried that because I talked to Lyle and got the dialogue off camera before, he won't offer it again. Yeah, he's not saying it. It's sad because it's like that's kind of a cool little like insight to him and Tom Nook and the Able Sisters and some of the other shopkeepers like character. So not being able to not being able to have that again on camera is gonna be sad, but I think he might recycle saying it. I don't think it's like a one time only thing. It's just certain days he offers it and certain days he doesn't. Hello, shrunk. The more I come here the more it's like really sad during the day. He's like he's not even cleaning. He's just kinda hanging out. And not doing much. I, re I gotta replant my Jacob's Ladder somewhere. I forgot. I should probably keep it, like, somewhere I can keep track of it. Because it's a rare flower. Don't want any of the villagers stealing it. They, like, walk up to it and they're like, eh, I'm gonna water it. And they slip it in their watering can and take it home. I'm gonna see it, like, in Profina's house or something. It's, if anyone, it's gonna be her that steals my precious Jacob's Ladder. I know the, the carnation and stuff, the Father's Day and Mother's Day flowers you can plant, but if they die, it's really hard to get another one. Thank you, thank you. My old teacher's thought joke is sure to cure what ails you. But, uh, I'm worried I won't be able to pull it off as well as you did. Guess I'll just have to give it a try. Prepare to see emotion in motion. You shall now see dots appear in the very air. You may wonder, can the master still summon thought dots after all these years? Does he still have the concentration it takes? Or do thought dots come only to the spring chickens. Watch as the master shows you how it's done. Okay, here goes. You just did it a bunch of times. What? I can't do it. Quick, play me off. I wonder what I did wrong. <laughs> oh, shrunk. He had the thought dots inside him the whole time. Alright. So let's get going here. Thank you guys for watching once again. Joining me in Gooston, as always. Leave a like if you enjoyed this. And uh, go home and think about your day. Hmm, maybe I should have built that flower clock instead. Either way, we'll get it done. See you guys next time for more Animal Crossing New Leaf. Goodbye.